Morning. Morning. I was I was too excited. Yeah, it's deal. like 10 o'clock, what are you doing? I am going to a rugby match today with Celinda Schoenmacher. I'm about to go meet her at Waterloo Station and then we're going to Twickenham. I don't even know which side we're cheering for. I have no idea what's in store for us today. I think we're gonna be very out of place in amongst all the rugby fans. We're a very gender equal couple. Yeah. Last night I drive over to yours, I make you dinner, <laughs> today I'm driving you to the rugby. Yeah, we're very progressive. Progressive with the times, yeah. yeah. I feel so out of place. Why? Because we're at the rugby and I don't know where we're going or what we I don't even know what team we're cheering for. I don't know what team we're cheering for, but look at that. These rugby boys behind you. Look at that ass. That's a great ass. Oh. Yeah! <sighs> Let's 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 very mellow. So very mellow. I feel like we are Yeah. Let's 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 Yeah. Um everyone's very calm and um it feels like we are more excited and I know nothing about rugby. Yeah. Kerry knows nothing about rugby. But we've not been in the stadium yet. They might be going crazy in there and this is where they come. This is where they here we go. I have no idea what's going on. I don't know what's happening. So for those of you that don't know, I am a quarter Welsh. My dad's dad, I think that's right, my dad's dad was Welsh. And Argentina and Wales are now playing, so I have a team to root for and it's really fun. And my queen is Argentinian. Did you know that? Rugby is just the most violent sport. I just don't understand why you would put yourself on a field to be essentially tackled and crushed by other massive men. It's like a special hug. It's like a special, special hug, violent, like, aggressive oh, hug. A really intense hug. It's like when you think something's so cute that you just want to hurt it. That's what they all think about each other. They're like, oh, I love you so much, I just want to tackle you to the ground and hurt you. I just want to hug you so bad. Just come here, let me hug you, let me hug you. <laughs> Enjoying the rugby dance. The next one is a trying to impress you dance. The next one is, I want to dance, but I'm actually pretty insecure. back to London because we are going to the premiere of Tomorrowland. Carrie and Celinda's day of fun. I'm really tired. Yeah, I'm really tired now. So now we're gonna sleep for a little bit. And then we're gonna put on really, really pretty dresses. And we're gonna walk down the red carpet. That is folded up in this backpack. Yeah. We've both just got backpacks. <laughs> With heels. Full of our like, fancy clothes. I don't know how we've done that. It's like magic, Mary Poppins magic carpet bags. Exactly. Celinda, where are we? On the red carpet. Blue. On, on, the, on the blue carpet. Blue like, where carpet. Is it? On the blue that. carpet of Tomorrowland. Just a world the rugby match. This is two worlds in one day. This is two worlds. Twickenham rugby match to Leicester Square premiere. <laughs> You know. I'm now on my way home, I'm still walking through Leicester Square, but it's a really weird feeling that I was just on the red carpet of a premiere in this big, like, elegant, flamboyant dress, and, you know, paparazzi people were, like, taking photos of me, and people were asking me for my autograph. And now I'm just back in a Doctor Who dress, just walking through Leicester Square like nothing ever happened. It's a really weird feeling. It's very, very strange. A little bit surreal. And now I'm gonna go home and I'm gonna have a bath. Good night. They come in lots of different shapes and sizes Some are spotty, some are tall and some are short